arrived. That key sign looks right, but then... This is it. Shut up. Foy's bum is on show, which is brilliant. But no, for real, this is this is the one I was talking about. It's not just a cross keys and I was hoping for the best anymore. It's the cross keys. From when I was a child. Okay. My round. Yeah. Take that. I'll go and buy a bit. Okay. Hi. We're in the cross keys. Uh, as I said earlier, it is it is definitely the same place I used to be in when I was a tiny child, I remember. Uh, running between the building and that other building bit there. It's crazy this place. I don't know what the fuck it used to be, but it's like loads of different little buildings and it's all pub. All pub. This is the best thing we've drunk all week. Frosty, tell us what it is. It's um, Stan's Cheddar Valley by Thatcher's. It's 6%. Murky as fox cider, bright orange. We sell it in the Petersgate tap. That's the Petersgate tap in Stockport. Do you want to give us an address there? 1980 St. Petersgate, Stockport. Peters. Come, and, come and see. More Peters. Uh, we sell it there mm, regularly. It's not house cider. House cider is Stan's, same company. Big Apple, which is 5% medium. This is a 6% medium, and all medium dry. Irrelevant. It is lovely. We were, uh, me and Krusty agreed that we should actually bring a box Krusty of this. Krusty and I. Krusty and I, Whitnail and I, decided that we should bring a box of this uh, very cider on holiday with us. And somehow we were vetoed by Foy. Two over, two over one. Kind of, yeah, I think it was two over one, and then we just kind of forgot about it. I've run out. Yeah, we, we could have brought a box, which is a twenty litre box. They come in twenty litres, thirty six pints. Uh, would have been a cost price about fifty quid. And it would have been the best thing we've done. I rate you ring your dad and tell him to get a box to us immediately. Nope. <laughs> there is a spare one in the cellar, but no. <laughs> Just in case you need another reason to think this pub was amazing, free chip butties. Yeah. Incredible. Apple cider vinegar, my hat. I can smell it, that smells equally incredible. This is is the turning point. Yes. Brilliant. This is the winding hole. Mm. We've turned around and now we're skirting the puffery. Mmm. Good job. This point on, everything is amazing. Mm. Crisp. Oh, they're boring playing That's oh. a good one. See it. That's Kev. What? Oh. What? My god, there is Kev. Why is Kevin? I don't care. I just love that he is. God, why is Kevin? Fuck that. Look, it's Kev. Get off the side of your brick. Why would he have that face? This is the best thing we've done for a week. I don't like that. I'm so confused here. Yeah, don't worry about that. There you go, have some chips. Yeah. Okay. No it's alright, wait, look, look, look. Thank you. This is the kind of amazing pub that it has. <laughs> I've also brought designated drivers. Shy. Please, why is this happening? I'm loving it. Oh, great. You're getting boating, kind of. I'm only here for it. But he's definitely going to give us a lift home back to the boat. We don't need that. We're done to doing that already. He's on his oh, way. Okay. I remember from Wallace. He is. <laughs> See you later. <laughs> Stop it. The continuing adventures of the four. <laughs> 
Oh, do it, dance. <laughs> Excellent dance. Excellent dance. I like the way that he's decided to drink that cider over the one he's not finished yet. That's great. Uh, don't worry, I will drink it. <laughs> I beat you, you're going to have to drink the cider. Gone. I can't just stand up. No, you can't. Feel right. free. I feel like I'm controlling the bot pit. Ah. Hello. <laughs> just annoying. Yeah. I'm doing light taps on you. I've got a camera in the other hand. Yep. <laughs> Have fun. Stay safe. I'm not saying your girlfriend's on fire, it's okay. Thank you for joining. Skip as well. Vicky, skip more. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Hope it came out on the video. Just like you tonight, when you're too drunk and you want to get Willie in your bum bum. I'm sure there's a joke there somewhere. He's trying, bless him, he's trying. Hello and welcome back to the boat. We're on the boat. Me and Foy are on we the boat. It. We did it. Yes. My dad drove us here it and then there was, a, there was a traffic incident oh, where someone was in a big truck and they were like, no friend. Full beams all the way, obviously. So we, we backed up and they carried on dipping their lights and we backed up some more and, they, and they, it was horrible. Uh, and, but, but we're on the boat now, it that's is. good. We're on the boat and Krusty is on the phone to Aimless. He's over there. There he is, look, there, see? Yeah. He's there on the boat is. now, yes, and now is. we're going to do a dinner, and it's mm. Krusty's dinner tonight, mm, so he's got to make some burgers. I, and I think he's not going to make I think he's going to fuck off. Yes, I'm feeling that as well, because it's literally, we've got the mint, and we've not done anything with it yet, and nobody's washed the plate, so... Me and Foy are here. Hello. It's what? five to midnight. We got back from the pub. We somehow, <laughs> somehow, and uh, Jay's been busy making burgers. You know what happened? I've been combining the mints. <laughs> That's all I've done. It looks like this dog. That's Jay's. <laughs> That's Jay's burgers. <laughs> Look, I did the chili and potatoes yesterday. This was your job. Here are the buns. Let's put the bun on the. Where are you pushing me over there? Oh, you've angered the boat now. Dinner. Which is mine? It's probably the fuller, to be fair, because it's you. You're the same, you fucking spastic. Oh, they know. That one's lesser. Where's mine? I don't know, you are on the phone for a million years, did you leave it? Oh, what a shot. There's some people behind me and I don't know what they're doing. We're at the tunnel, it's 11 o'clock. There it is, looking all dark and ominous. <clears throat> Got a boat in front of us. So, I think when they go through, we wait. 30 minutes or something like that and then we go through it's quite staggered uh, which is irritating because it's like gone 11 o'clock now uh, don't know whether we're waiting for one final boat to come through from the other side and then we can start progressing that is one of the men that will help us through the boat through the tunnel uh, we've got to have someone on board at all times which is exciting and new Still waiting for the tunnel. <sighs> Jay got bored, so we decided to enter the shit box. Well, not. Oh, to replace it, change it. Plain one, pooey weedy one. I've gotten this far. It's sick. I don't want to be a poo bucket guy. You're a poo bucket guy. Because the thing is, I know I've got to lift it up to slide it into that thing, and I don't want to. 
because it's heavy. And the reason it's heavy is because it's full of shit. <laughs> I'm pissed, don't forget pissed. Don't forget the piss. So I'm not, I'm not my happiest. I don't think I'm hung over today despite how incredibly pissed I was last night. But I've, I've decided now I feel broken at least. Because of this. So I can do it. Right. Oh. Oh. You can hear it feel like splashing about. smells as I pushed it back into the thing. Oh no. <laughs> okay. The worst part's over with me. Is oh. it though? Because this supposedly empty one has sloshiness in it. <coughs> Good, I'm pushing it and I'm moving the toilet. I can't. Is it in? Hold on to the toilet. <laughs> Sounded good. I don't know. Open the bowl and check the flap. It looks right. Well, come and look at the toilet. Excuse the shit marks. <laughs> that was Jay. No, it wasn't. Alright, push it back against the wall then. Open the flap then. <laughs> well done, Jeff. You did very well. And so begins the worst day of my life. <laughs> okay, so the time is 20 to 1. Uh, we've got to wait till half 1 to go through the tunnel. Because someone rocked up behind us. Uh, which was the shuffle boat and they wanted to go first and the person ahead said okay and we weren't consulted on this matter people started going through at 12 which is not the uh, the 11 o'clock that we first were told and then we've got to wait 45 minutes I want to say individuals but that's not the word I'm not doing well today intervals. thank you intervals um, so half one it is in the meantime, I've put on a hoodie and changed pants to long pants to be warm, and then the sun has immediately come out, so I need to change back again. Um, so that's where we're at right now. Oh wait, no, there was something else. The aerial's not on the roof anymore, because we had to take it off to be the right height. We have filled the water thing to beyond capacity to be ballast. <laughs> and uh boy's cider torch doesn't work anymore <laughs> <laughs> that happened yesterday we didn't film that we should have you owe me four quid there we go it's working now that's the shame before we uh it's in the ginger beer this time <laughs> we had the lovely 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 cider last night and keeping with weavy boating tradition of voice torch going in wet things <laughs> <laughs> i put it in his pint three times he got angry so he took it out Disassembled <laughs> it to dry out, put it back together, and I immediately put it back in the pants. <laughs> it was great. Anyway, what's going on here? Uh, Evaporation has occurred over there. Yeah, we've lost our shit. The scratch cover, which one of those moments where we're just so miserable and down that anything is funny, and some water vapor evaporating, and it was hilarious. Not but a minute ago. Including the socks in the oven. The socks are in the oven. The shoes are in the engine. The sausages are in the cupboard. <laughs> the ducks have eaten all the spiders <laughs> and we've run out of potatoes. <laughs> Apart from that, everything's <laughs> shit. I've been saying for days we've probably been missing something for uh, the inverter. 
Right, look at this. Watch, watch what happens when I turn it on now. We have fucking power. Crusty, please, what did you just do? Well, I've been sat in the engine bay for about 15 minutes just with the sun on my back enjoying myself. <clears throat> Just kind of looking at the engine, uh, and then Jay comes along and says, "We must be missing something." And I, I've always known that he's right. I just don't want to admit that we're missing something. Because when I looked before, this is the—that's the power going to the inverter. They follow it up. The neggy goes on there. The posi comes into this. Now I thought originally in my memory when I checked it, that was this wire. But it's not, it's, it's this wire. So it goes to here, and I thought, what's this? And that goes up, and that goes into this. And then that goes out, and goes to that. So that was like that, and I didn't pay it a moment's heed. And I've just realised that when we came to the boat on Monday to set it up, that was off, and that cap was on. And I thought, that looks like a cap. And there's a spare key in the boat. That we've not used yet it's for the inverter <laughs> so what, all you've done is turn it on <clears throat> uh, well I've connected it's technically disconnected those switches break the circuit right. so it's been taken out uh, just as a yeah, that's for precaution the last time it was used and we've not put it back in that is new that wasn't a thing the last time we took this boat out. I never had to do that before. Okay, but well, we've done it now, and that means we can put tunes on immediately, except we're gonna go through a tunnel shortly, so we better not. Yeah, but when we get out of the tunnel. It's gonna be a fucking rollicking good time. Yeah. I'm finally put my playlist on. I've been working on for like six months. Yeah, the good thing is we can get everything nice and charged. Yeah, I've, I've decided already I'm not gonna care about my phone anymore. I'm just gonna fucking use all the apps at once because I can charge my phone, Yeah, which is great news. I'm relieved and also really, really pissed off that I didn't sit and stare at the engine yesterday. Oh well. It's fine. We've got power for the rest of the week. We can charge your laptop. Char that's what I mean, charge that's, your laptop for tonight. That's immediately going to happen right now. Charge a laptop for barbecue night tonight. If we can find a butcher's. We, we, well, no, I found a butcher's. Oh, yeah, we, we have, yeah. To it. yeah. I'd like to point out that these guys, look, come here, come with me. Whee. Are now going through the tunnel. They were meant to go through, I think, at quarter to one. The time now is four minutes to one, so that makes us late. We're probably not going anywhere till. I'd put money on us not going in until quarter two. Yeah. Which is obviously gash, but I've always had a poo and everything's okay. Coming up half one, nearly time to rock and roll. I went inside to change my t-shirt to something lighter. Got as far as taking my t-shirt off and thought, nah, I've earned this. It's sunny. Don't need a t-shirt. This is warm. It was a second ago. Anyway, I've come to see you because you're looking at this tunnel. There's a noise. I can hear a noise. The light not work. What light? That, that light. That light. Uh, no, from the battery out well, charge. That's a damn shame. Don't worry, it'll be in there. There it is. This is the easiest bit. I don't know why I can see my own breath here. <sighs> probably, I'm probably breathing in the smoke, and the, but it, it, there is a definite chill. I mean, like from here, there is a chill. Right, warm, 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 warm. This is cold now. Yeah, getting that. I wasn't can you can you hear the noise as well? I think it's got a train, right? Well, it would have appeared by now. I think it's just tunnel noise. I'm wondering if it's that bloody boat's engine. Maybe. Half an hour in, we can still hear it. Where else is the sound going to go? Who knows? Look at that. You've looked it enough. Pause it. You know the rules by now. <clears throat> Over. There's something pretty over there. Right. Why have we not thought to come and explore no, sooner? We have now. We've still got time. Look at these. Grow your own plants. Plants. <laughs> this side, we have alarmingly close train track. That is alarmingly close. 
the fella that we were talking to before uh, was saying that all this is uh, what they dug out of the tunnel. That's what the train tracks based on. Oh, they just they chucked it over here and they used it. Spoil, he said. Spoil. That's the word for it. Not shit. Not shit. Spoil. Yeah, very impressive. Meanwhile, you come with me, I'll show you something else. Good just earlier. Good ramble down to. I'm not sure that I'm going to. Is it the Diggle Hotel? Uh, no. I don't like steps like this that are only like a two inch rise. Yeah, they do. Where are you taking me, Jay? This way. Yeah, I trust you. Good. You're going to put me deep into the woods. You yeah. Continue to trust me. <laughs> okay. Well, uh, better start getting me safety gear on. The safety gear's a thing. Look, pretty. Oh, wow. That is pretty. Those ramshackle steps. <clears throat> Good ramble down to it. A babbling brook. Not that rambling, because it's stairs, obviously. Terrifying shit stairs, but stairs all the same. Probably a spider on me there, because of course. And um, it's just a five, ten minutes. <clears throat> I've got to wear safety gear. I am doing the driving. This pile of safety gear is what I'm going to put on. Give me the camera and put your safety gear on, you're safe. I've got to put my layers on. I've got to put my warm layer on. And you've got to put your waterproof layer on. And then I've got... A pint. A pint? Yeah, have a pint as you go through the tunnel. For extra safety. Yeah. Beer fueled confidence. I've got this thing here that beeps as well. Did you get why the hard hats are so essential? That's why. Oh my god. It's just like that time you caught your head in a bridge. Yeah, funny I've had one of Indeed. You would have had your head ripped off. Yeah. There'd be less room. Yeah. I think about that sometimes and I'm terrified of what could have occurred that day. Yeah. Ah, here's the train. If only we'd been next to it at the time of being over there. So I've got high vis and camo on at the same time. <laughs> oh no, these water camo as well. Presumably they balance each other out. Yeah. Some of them's invisible. Fine, hard to decide. Babby's first jacket. <laughs> I doubt it. I don't think it will. No. No. Chin strap doesn't really feel like. <laughs> The tunnel is no respecter of fashion. Yeah. Rip your head off either way. Indeed. That's what it wants to do. Ah, I'm all set. Yeah, most of, uh, most of the damage on the top comes from the bits they restored. Uh, when they reopen the tunnel, which is done in like a spray concrete, it's just like, you know, it's like coarse sandpaper when you touch it, it's, uh, it's really bad. But there are one or two places where they've left uh, rock boats sticking down in rather awkward places, so I'll tell you when we get to those. But, uh, like everything else, it's all out in the middle around Red Brook. Really. <laughs> 